Hi, I'm Gary Freeman Sr. We're here for Pylon Racing uh, this week. We're building up from the uh, entry class all the way up to what I call the hot rod starting tomorrow. Uh, we're in the finals right now. Uh, I've been part of the model airplane since I got into it with my dad when I was 12 years old. And I pretty much, except for the time I spent in the Navy, which was, I shot airplanes off an aircraft carrier. So I still was with the airplanes. And after I came out, I got back into it. And through the years, have uh, progressed to the point that I now manufacture the uh, hot rods or the Q40s. And my son has been with me, probably teamed up racing with me over 30 years. So, like you said, i am uh, been racing with him for quite a while. I'm Gary Freeman Jr. Um, I, Got my first race under my belt when I was probably 12 and my first nationals, I believe I was 15 or 16. Uh, I've only missed about two or three since then. So Brody got into it, uh, obviously uh, coming out and hanging out with dad and I out at the field and in the shop and showed an interest very early on. Uh, he actually soloed about two years ago and his first race was in December. And this was his first really big race with the 426 and the quarter 40s. So he's doing very well. Uh, he actually, for his first nationals, beat my first nationals by about 30 seconds. So he's uh, he's got the talent there. So we're looking forward to that. Um, we do a lot of sport flying at least uh, two or three times a month throughout the field. So he's got the thumbs. Uh, for me, the competition just gives you that adrenaline rush, and uh, you know it's the technical aspect of it. Um, it actually drove my career up. I'm a flight test engineer for Lockheed Martin, so uh, I think it's, it's it's good to get those fundamentals down. And, and it's, there's, I couldn't imagine a better hobby to do it with than this. Between the tuning of the engines and understanding the electronics and you know aerodynamics, it, it's, it covers a lot of bases, and, and it's always been intriguing to me. And it's, it's carried over to, to Rody. He has uh, engineering aspects, uh, aspirations, I should say, for, for his future. Well, ever since I was 16 years old, if it had a motor on it, I tore it down to see if I could get it to go faster. So, like Gary was saying, it's the adrenaline rush. It's the it's that feeling of once it's up in the air and you you, you forget everything except its speed, and here we go. Mm -hmm. I mainly like uh, model aviation because it's fun. You learn new things. And it's fun meeting new people and learning a lot of new things. The thing I saw that was very heartwarming and cool was that most everybody here was very open arms and welcoming for Brody to get in. And I remember that as a kid, and that's what kind of kept me the drive to continue to do it. I could see it in him. He actually might have it a little bit more than I did. It, you know, just it's good to have kind of that family feel from everybody out here. More importantly, because you know you don't see a lot of youth coming into the hobby, so that that helps out a lot. And you know, maybe talk some of his buddies into coming out and trying it. And just, it's good to have that feeling of, of family, like I said.